Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be my October favorites and I actually don't have that many items but I still wanted to share the things that I was really loving this past month with you regardless. So let's just start off with the one thing that I've really been obsessed with and it's this Paul Mitchell curly wand. You guys saw me do like a demo of it and honestly ever since then I've been using it as much as I can just because that's how obsessed I am with this. This thing is amazing. I thought my last curling wand was amazing. Hell no. This is like 30 times better. And for the price and the fact that you can have interchangeable wands, I feel like it's freaking amazing. So again, this is what it looks like. Just basic wand. You know, you interchange it. And yeah, guys, love it. The last time that I checked on Ulta, they were still having it on sale. So hopefully once I link it down, it's still on sale. Hopefully. Now, the next item that I want to share with you guys is this cute little phone stand just because I've been kind of making TikToks. I know, I know. Guilty pleasure. <laughs> and I really needed a nice um, stand just because my old one, it's the ones that you bend. And the thing is that that one, once you bend it, it never goes back to being straight. So when I wanted it straight, it was never perfect. So then I found this one and it comes with a remote. But I don't know where my kids left it, so you can use it um, with your phone, you know, take photos or videos, whatever you need to do. And yeah, let me just show you. So it's this nice, cute little stand like this. And what I really like about it is the fact that not only can you expand it this way, but if you needed it to be taller, it gets way taller, as you can tell. And obviously, if you want to carry it with you in your bag for people that take photos of themselves in places... You know, you can just put it back to, just press it back down and it'll go back to the same small size that it was. And just to give you a comparison, my hand is not really that big. But as you can tell, next to my hand, it's only maybe like an inch and a half taller here. About an inch, inch and a half. So yeah, so you can really carry it in a nice tote or a backpack. And then another great thing that I really love about this is the fact that it has like this little wheel here that you can turn and if you want to or if you need to you know change the angle of your camera or a uh, phone you can do that so really love that feature that you can just kind of move it around a little bit and you can obviously as you can tell you can move it around almost circular not completely but almost so yeah i really recommend this and i will for sure link this down below i did purchase it on amazon i think most of these items people usually find them on amazon now the next product that I want to share with you guys is this sunscreen and it's from Neutrogena so ultra sheer body mist obviously it's not anything new but it's new to me and I've really been loving it I follow this older woman sorry kick the stand I follow this older woman on tiktok but she has such a beautiful skin and one of her things is she says that really changed her skincare she'll, she'll if you like look back at some of her videos she'll show you before and after and she's like adamant about sunscreen, putting it under makeup, over makeup, reapplying it throughout the day. Even if you're at home, just, you know, spray it. So I decided to purchase this just to do, to do make it, to make it, to apply it over my makeup. And I love the fact that obviously it gives a bonus is that it gives you a nice dewy factor to the skin. Now the only downfall to this is that it does kind of get everywhere. So when you, like this, whenever I, whenever I apply it, I have a headband on my hair. Just to try not to get it anywhere all over my hair, but it does, you know, get a little messy. That's the only downfall. But aside from that, I really love it. I love the fact that it just gives you like a natural glow. So yeah, I really like this for over my makeup. Only when I do my makeup. Besides that, I just do regular sunscreen. Now another kind of like skincare product that I really love, and I'm always mentioning it just because I'm still obsessed with it, is this Biosense Squalene Hyaluronic Toning Mist. It looks like that and I know you guys have seen me mention it. I basically mention it every month but it's because I am that obsessed with it. And I mean I'm, I'm almost going to be to the halfway mark. I know by the end of this month for sure I'll be like more than halfway. But yeah I just can't get enough of this. I love the way it leaves my skin. Nice and moisturized. Doesn't break me out. All that good stuff. And then another skincare product that I have is the Shiseido Essentials Energy Eye Definer. But it's, it's just an eye cream. And I had this for a while but I stopped using it but i've actually particularly have been using it during the day so this is like my day eye cream and then my night my night eye cream is the biosense that i currently have it's very nice and light feels very cool when you apply it on the skin and it looks like this 
comes in a little tubey and I actually love the fact that it comes in a tube and then it has like a little metal head you can squeeze it out and then obviously apply it on under the eyes and then just roll it out massage it with this but what I do is I just squeeze it out tap it on my uh, finger and then just apply it that's just my preferred method but yeah just really nice light refreshing eye cream and I really recommend to anyone that has dry under eyes I think maybe you would really like this the next product that I have to mention is this Clio razor looks like this and it's just a regular razor you know you just turn it on looks like that I'm not focusing but I hope you guys can kind of see it but I particularly have been using this for my eyebrow area just because here in California you know we've been on lockdown since 1943 and I can't go to my eyebrow girl so I'm trying my best to keep my eyebrows maintained and I particularly use this for here just because I feel like this razor actually leaves a way smoother application than when I pluck it out and I'm not willing to wax my eyebrows because I don't trust myself because I genuinely know that if I like any wax or if I over tweeze my eyebrows it's like game over for me like if there's one thing I know I can literally not do is my eyebrows and that's why I always pay for them to get done and so I'm trying my best to just kind of keep them clean and this has helped so much just like I said because it leaves just specifically this area nice and smooth I have used it under here but I prefer just regular um, tweezers for that area but just here in the middle and then sometimes if I want to take away a little bit of hair here leaves it beautiful now the next product that I have I wish I would have worn it today but it's just because I'm going to be doing another nail polish color it's this Expressi nail polish from Etsy from Etsy sorry and the shade Taxi Hop and I've been using this color like crazy I love mustard green poop colored nail polishes and this one in particular I would really recommend I wish you guys can see but I, I have like the nail polish down to here just because of how much I've been using it this month my favorite color so far I love like obsessed with these types of mustardy um, yellows and again I really recommend you guys check it out if you haven't the formula is amazing it does dry down super quickly like they say it does and it does not give me like an uneven coat at least not when I use it so yeah good stuff right here and now the next products that I have are all makeup related and then that's basically it I don't really have that many other makeup stuff yeah so the first product that I want to mention is this Stila Sheer, I don't know if it's Peony or Peony, either or, it's going to be Tomato Tomato, so don't come for me. It's this Stila Cream Blush, again in the shade Sheer Peony, and it looks like, so if there's hair on it, I'm sorry, it's my, it's my bed, it keeps shedding like crazy. But yes, it looks like so, and it's literally one of the best formulas, I feel like no one talks about them. And they're so underrated. Stila makes such beautiful, beautiful, beautiful cream. Blushes blend so easily. I've been using them for a year. I purchased this like a while ago. But I've recently been um, using it more in my makeup routine. And I love it. And it is true to its name of it being sheer. Because the regular cream formula, when you apply it, you literally just need one dab. And it's like a lot of pigment. This one, you have to do two if you want a lot of color to your cheeks. But regardless, even if you do, it blends out so nicely that there's not one issue with blendability or it, like picking up your makeup or anything like that. So beautiful. And then the next product that I have to mention, I wish I would have worn this, but it's, I'm testing out some other products on my face. That's the only reason why I'm not wearing them. Is this Guerlain Light Essential Natural Glow Foundation. And I feel like I can attest to the fact that it is glowy because literally every time I put this stuff on, my face looks like I just woke up from the best nap of my life. Like you guys know that that face you have when you have like a great sleep. Like it just looks like very lit and awakened. Well I feel like every time I wear this that's what it gives me. Now this isn't my exact shade. I do have a blue mixer that I put in here just because I'm olive so it gives it more of a green tint to it. But when I do it is amazing. And now that I'm mentioning this foundation, I want to mention this brush that I've been using with this foundation. And I actually also wore it, I mean, I actually, I actually used it today with another foundation that, I, that I'm currently wearing. And I've just really been loving the way that this Kabuki has been leaving my makeup. I feel like it leaves a very 
you know, skin like with the finish. I know um, I'm very into more like natural looking makeup, but I just noticed that a couple of different foundations, this has been leaving it beautiful, nice and glowing, nothing thick or, you know, brush strokes or anything anywhere. And yeah, and you can get these so cheap, guys. This is from Tarte. It's their Kabuki brush. Mine has a cute little glitter handle, as you can tell. And the reason why I purchased the glitter handle, aside from it's really cute, it was on sale. It's literally the same thing as a regular one that's regular price. If you ever go to the sale section, they always have a different handle, but it's the same brush. And I really recommend, you know, just buy the sell, the, the one on sale. Just because, like I said, it's the same thing, just different handle. So... If you do check it out, for sure, check out the sale section first before you purchase it full price. That's just my take on it. And that's it for my makeup products. I only have two kind of like lifestyle things that I want to mention to you guys. And the first one that I want to mention is this beautiful pajama. It's a set, but I only have a top, so I'm just going to show you the top. And it's from Target, and it is the brand, um, I think it was Star and Above star stars yeah stars above and mine is actually in a large just because i like the looser fit on myself i like to be very comfortable nothing tight on me so i ended up purchasing the large but i'm pretty sure if i would have gotten the medium it would have been true to size so in case you guys are wondering i believe just because you know the large actually fits me a little bit oversized i believe that the medium would have been true to size so if you like something more true to size go for that or obviously if you want something a little bit more looser fit then obviously go the next size up but these feel amazing guys like go to your pajamas section and then i know at my target i've seen them there so really just go to that section look for the stars and above pajama section and just feel them they feel so nice buttery beautiful and they don't also they don't only just have short sleeve they have long sleeve they have pants and then they also sell them separate so in case you just want to purchase one item instead of purchasing the whole set just because you're not sure how you're going to feel about the product i really 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 would recommend them to you guys and yeah that's love it i have the the pajama pants in the bottom as you can tell yes super comfy and now the last product that i want to share with you guys is my belt bag i am so obsessed with this thing i've been wearing it like crazy if you go to my instagram most of my pictures i am wearing this belt bag because it's just so cute goes with everything so fashionable and i have worn it out and as you can tell it still looks really 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 well so it's it's maintaining its shape and everything so yeah love it love it love it i hope they come out with the beige one because if they do i'm purchasing it because that's how obsessed i am with this one that i wanted in a lighter shade and i really hope terry butch please come out a beige color or taupey color whatever because i will purchase it i will be the first one to purchase it but yeah guys that is it for my monthly favorites i hope you guys like this video and i'll see you guys next time bye